Hey guys, we are live out here at the 111th edition of the Oklahoma State Fair. I'm Maggie Carlo. We're so glad that you're joining us. What is going on behind us? This is the biggest attraction here. Really, it's bigger, better, best this year at the Oklahoma State Fair. And this is the Sky Eye Ferris Wheel. This thing, twice the size, Scott tells me, of the Wheeler Ferris Wheel to give you some perspective. It is the largest portable Ferris Wheel in the country, and it is here. Only the fourth or fifth showing, Scott, and we got this thing. So, you, you know, uh, you got to come and, and get on this thing. Other things that folks are looking forward to is the food. Every year you want to come back for your fair favorites, but you guys have some new things this year. You always are coming up with something new. We do. Behind us you'll see uh, Cutie Pies, that red trailer. That is uh, the place where you can find your watermelon pie. Uh, we've got America's Comfort Food uh, mac and cheese topped with uh, either roast pork, buffalo chicken, bacon cheddar, and chives. Uh, Got uh, the Orr Family Farm has got their uh, family recipe for their chocolate chip cookies out here. We've got uh, La Gumbo Yaya with uh, red beans and rice on a stick. We've got Cocoa Flow with the unicorn crepe. Uh, there's plenty of new food items spread throughout the grounds. Uh, there's a meatloaf cupcake up with the sweet shop inside gate one. It's a it's meatloaf topped with uh, mashed potato icing and then they put uh, bacon and uh, cheese as little sprinkles on the top of it. So they're the people that brought us the roast beef sundae a couple years ago. So they're always looking for something new and different. And uh, the, the unicorn crepe, let's talk through the, the fixings on that. Talk about what is in that thing, because everything's unicorn. 2017 seems to be the, 2017 is the year of the unicorn, so this makes sense. Well, it's got uh, raspberry cream on it. It's got uh, pop rock mousse. Uh, it's got colors galore on it. I'm excited to try it because I want to see what happens when those pop rocks get in my mouth. <laughs> you know the kids are, are jonesing for that too. And also bacon wrapped, pretty much anything you want bacon wrapped, you can have it here at the fair. Yeah, we like to say if you can put it on a stick, wrap it in bacon, dip it in chocolate and fry it, that's what you're going to find out here at the Oklahoma State Fair. This is not the time to be on a diet. You need to come out and enjoy the food for the 11 days of the Oklahoma State Fair. Yeah, talk about that because uh, the folks that made the chicken leg famous, they're trying something a little quote unquote healthier this year. What is that? A, a spin on Brussels sprouts? Yeah, they're going to uh, bacon wrap Brussels sprouts and also bacon wrap zucchini. So not only do they offer you the caveman turkey leg wrapped in a pound of a giant turkey leg wrapped in a pound of bacon, then they also have a healthy offering with the zucchini and the uh, Brussels sprouts. We'll see what happens. We'll see who wins that battle. I, I love that they're trying to make sure we're getting our veggies in. And as we're talking here, we just got to take a look back here again. Scott at the Sky Eye Ferris Wheel. This again, the largest Ferris Wheel, portable Ferris Wheel in North America. And you can see the crews using various tools. They are building it. It's only partially built there. So your eyes are not deceiving you. They are in the process of building this thing. Uh, there's a lot of excitement around it. Yeah, there is. You know, it's just like we said earlier, this is only the fourth time it's been set up. We're very excited that our carnival provider, Wade Shows, brought it in in partnership with Michael Woods. Uh, as you see, it's about two-thirds or three-quarters of the way full. It'll be finished, obviously, in time for the opening tomorrow, and it'll be a great ride to get up on top of it. And you'll be able to see, obviously, not only a good panoramic view of the State Fair itself, but you can see from miles around. And it'll also be a beacon in the night when you're traveling down here to State 40 or coming down 44. So we're excited about it. The pictures, ah, oh, the social media pictures that you're going to be having, Scott. Scott, thank you for joining us this morning. We My so pleasure. appreciate it.